the summer of 1941 and the German Reich, alongside its Romanian allies, marches ever deeper into the vast territories of the Soviet Union. The southern sector of the Eastern Front is a key battleground and it is here that Romanian units, allied with the might of the Wehrmacht, play a crucial role in the unfolding drama of war. In the early morning light, a column of Romanian soldiers marches past the camera. Their faces, hardened by battle and the grueling pace of the advance, show determination and resolve. Each man is captured in close-up, a portrait of duty and sacrifice. Some young, others older, but all united in their mission. Boots stamp against the dirt road in unison. Weapons slung over their shoulders as they move steadily forward, ever deeper into enemy territory. Nearby, Romanian and German officers gather around a field table, the air thick with the tension of war. Maps are unfurled across the table, detailing the terrain and positions of Soviet forces. The camera lingers on a Romanian officer, a man of distinction, wearing the Iron Cross, a symbol of his valor and the alliance between the Axis powers. Binoculars in hand, the officers scan the horizon, looking for the next opportunity to strike. signals the arrival of a motorcycle messenger, dust kicking up as he speeds toward the command post. The message is handed over with haste, its contents vital for the next phase of the operation. Moments later, the officers are on the field phone, their voices urgent as they coordinate the advancing forces.
another motorcycle messenger, this time Romanian, arrives to deliver additional orders, underscoring the rapid pace at which the front line shifts. aftermath of battle, victory is declared. High above an ornate building, soldiers hoist the battle flag of the Third Reich, its bold emblem fluttering in the wind. Below, the Romanian flag is draped proudly across the facade, a symbol of the shared triumph between Germany and its ally. shifts to the port, where ships move in and out of the harbour, the waters still haunted by the wreckage of war. The remnants of sunken ships bob in the waves, reminders of the fierce battles fought for control of these crucial waters. There is a momentary break in the footage. A gap in the visual narrative leaves a sense of mystery, a brief silence before the next chapter unfolds. When the scene returns, it reveals a bustling city. Crowds of civilians gather on the sidewalks, watching as German troops march in, their boots echoing on the pavement. The buildings around them are marked by Cyrillic writing, indicating a city deep within Soviet territory. It is clear, the Axis forces have penetrated far, bringing the war to the very heart of the Soviet Union. shifts once more to a ceremonial moment. A German general steps forward to award iron crosses to a group of soldiers, each man standing tall as the decoration is pinned to their chest. Close-up shots reveal the pride etched on their faces, a recognition of their bravery and sacrifice on the front lines. Behind them, officers gather, exchanging smiles and words of congratulations the mood jovial despite the hardships they have endured. The march continues. A signpost comes into view, its place names a reminder of the vast distances covered in this relentless campaign. Horse-drawn military carts rumble along the road, laden with supplies and equipment for the troops ahead. The men continue onward, knowing that the road to victory is long, but confident in their progress. This is the story of the Einsatz Rumänische Einheiten im Südabschnitt der Ostfront, the story of Romanian units fighting alongside their German allies in the summer of 1941. It is a tale of fierce determination, rapid advances and hard-won victories in the sprawling fields of Russia. As the flags wave high and the soldiers march ever forward, the southern sector of the Eastern Front becomes a testament to the power of an alliance forged in war.